Hello, everyone, and welcome to this week's episode of Pulp Crazy. I'm your host, Jason Aiken. In this week's episode, I will be discussing The Prophecy by U.B. Cave. It first appeared in the October 1934 issue of Black Book Detective. The Prophecy can be categorized more as a horror story than a detective or crime story. I would peg the time period that it takes place around the year it was published, in 1934. It involves four young whites who decide to pay a visit to a black church that is deep into the spiritualist movement of the day. As a matter of fact, a nice name drop to Sir Arthur Conan Doyle is made in the story. A fifth member of the group warns the four of them against going, insisting that something bad will happen to them. Hence the title of the story. The Prophecy is a pretty solid horror story. Cave is a pretty talented writer. He sets the mood and atmosphere inside the black church quite well. I enjoyed another tale I read of his titled The Price of Vengeance and was eager to read another story written by him. While Cave doesn't spend a lot of time fleshing out the four main characters, you kind of know what you're in for with them from the start. The people who worship at the church are far more interesting in my eyes. My favorite character was the black preacher who is a giant of a man with shoulders cut using carpenter squares. Now, on top of his physically imposing appearance, spirits also move through him while he is preaching at the podium. Another interesting character at the church is a young white kid who is prone to convulsions. He might be the spookiest of the bunch. I don't want to say too much more about how the four's visit to the church goes, in case you want to read the story. It's available to read for free on Pulp Gen, and there is also a robotic audio recording available on archive.org. It's not very good, but it's something if you're unable to actually read the story. I'll link to both in the show notes. Now I do have to point out a downside to this story. I'd heard about racism in the pulps, but never encountered it to such a vast extent until this story. The dialogue from the blacks especially could be found offensive. The words are spelled out phonetically in a stereotypical fashion, so be wary of that. I would say if you were offended a great deal by this portrayal of blacks, just don't read the story at all. It isn't that good to overcome the ratio of stereotypes within the story. It's a, de it's a pretty good horror story, but it's just not quite that good to uh, have to read through 11 pages of that stuff if um, you're offended by that. So I would uh, recommend that you skip it if that's the case. I'll try to look for other stories by UB Cave that are online because I do think he is a good writer and I'd be interested to see him write in different genres. The Price of Vengeance was an adventure story set in Africa and this story, The Prophecy, is a horror tale. So maybe I'll try to find maybe a historical story by him. Um, Maybe a sports story, if he ever writ, wrote any of those. Or maybe even go back to Adventure, because I really liked uh, The Price of Vengeance. So maybe I'll try to find more African tales or other tales of adventure by him. Well, that's it for this week's episode. Pulp Crazy is located at PulpCrazy.com. I'm at PulpCrazy on Twitter and facebook.com slash pulpcrazy. 
My YouTube channel is youtube.com slash pulpcast. You can also email me at pulpcrazy at gmail.com. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you next time.